Two guards at the Allegheny County Jail are recovering tonight after they were stabbed by two inmates yesterday. Police say Douglas Lockett and Dekill Blair attacked the officers during a cell inspection. One guard was slashed on the arm and shoulder and head. He's still in the hospital. The other was stabbed in the shoulder. Now, the mother of two Allegheny County Jail guards is fearful about the safety of her sons following those stabbings. Bob Allen has her story. As a mother, I have the right to protect my children. And I'm not only trying to protect my children, I'm trying to protect every guard in the county jail. Lisa Leitner believes the Allegheny County Jail Guard stabbed by two inmates could have easily been her two sons who are also jail guards. She says guards are not allowed to talk to the media, so she's exercising her right to freedom of speech by asking questions. She wonders how Douglas Lockett, a man convicted of murder, and 19-year-old to kill Blair gained access to two shanks described as six to eight inch spikes with cloth handles. How do you make a shank in jail on a life sentence? Why did he have that, that, that ability? Why, if they would have put him in a solitary confinement, there would have been no way for him to access anything but a cell. Life doesn't matter to him. His life is over. Life is life. Um, he didn't care when he shot the person he was found guilty of, so he obviously didn't care about the guards. Leitner also questions the safety of the jail, and she says guards are working too much mandatory overtime. When you have officers that are running two and three shifts at a time, mm -hmm. How good is their safety? How alert and oriented could they be? Both inmates face additional criminal charges, including attempted homicide and aggravated assault. Let's protect the guards. You know, they have, they should have more rights than the criminals. Bob Allen, KDKA TV News. County police say they continue to investigate how and why this happened.